going on guys we're ready to kick off another one let's do it Alright guys, so we're just getting ready to load up and head up to a facility where we need to repair a dock plate. There's some broken welds and then there's a bumper on the outside of the building that the customer tried to weld on but they didn't have the greatest welder and so, and so it needs to be cut off and they're going to give me a whole new bumper and I'll weld it on. They also want me to add some stitching on the floor plate inside the building. Now I asked them if I could film the work for my YouTube channel. They said they don't allow filming, but we'll discuss it when you get here. So I told them in the text that I wouldn't be filming the facility, their product, anything like that. All I would be filming is the actual work. So you really wouldn't even be able to tell where I was at. So we'll see what they say. I may end up being able to get some video on this. I may not. So. We're going to load up the torches because I'm afraid that where the customer has welded the bumper on, it's going to be hard to get to and I think there's a lot of real heavy weld on there. Instead of having to grind it off, maybe I could just scarf it off with a scarfing tip. So we'll load this up and then we're going to double check that we've got everything we need and we'll head up there. This is one more reason. That I really would like to get that stinking trailer done. There's just a lot going on right now. guys good news we are going to be able to film this one we're just going to try to respect the customer we're not going to show anything business name product anything like that so here's what we got we just need to cut this off they didn't really have the type of welder they needed to weld this on and they don't feel good about it so we're going to go ahead and cut it off there's the new one so we'll just slap that up there and we'll weld this out see there's a couple welds there and then there's some welds on the inside and we'll show you guys when we get to that point but we're gonna start with this bumper here so let's do it Okay, so we got that all prepped up. You can see we knocked the paint off of it. There's really only two spots we can get weld. Here and here. So I knocked the paint off there. And I knocked the paint off there. So now we'll throw it up there. We'll get this bolt on. And then we'll get it tacked up. And we'll start welding it out.
I'm having trouble getting the ground. Plus, this is all zinc plated, which is fun. Okay, we're tacked up. Now we're just going to run these welds. one more to this one. I don't like how it looks in one little spot, so I'm going to add one more on top of it. Okay, so we got that one done. This one's all done. So now we gotta go inside and do some repairs on the floor. There's some cracks. We'll gouge those out, we'll weld them back up, and then we're gonna add some more weld, just a few stitches to reinforce it. So we'll do that now. Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know how We got the dock plate done, got it all welded out. We're gonna roll up and get out of here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. This one was a fairly quick one, but another mobile job in the books. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Now, I asked him if I could film it for the YouTube. Now I asked him if I could film this. Goodness. So we'll gouge those out. We'll weld them.